Nicola Badalana here from PixieHill.com with a new project for you from Gypsy Soul Laser Cut. We're going to use Garden Fairy Cutouts to create an adorable lantern. Begin by bending the cutout and breaking up the paper fibers so you'll get better adhesion to the rounded sides of your jar. I'm using a fast drying instant glue. You can use whichever glue you are most comfortable with. Hold the figure in place until it is set. If your jar has a pattern or decoration on it, be sure to place the fairy figure on the opposite side of the jar. Apply a layer of white glue to the outside of the clean glass jar. Place a layer of tissue paper on top and smooth it out. Continue around the jar, working in sections until it is covered. A little bit of overlap is fine, but try to avoid too many layers of tissue as each layer will reduce the amount of light that shines from your fairy jar. Consider other elements for your jar, like floral cutouts, stars, or maybe even baby dragons. Don't worry too much about small tears and wrinkles. You can camouflage these with glitter later. Turn the jar upside down and allow to dry. Once dry, apply some glue to the top and bottom edges and add clear glitter. This will create a sort of vignette and add an extra dash of magic. I would not suggest covering the entire jar with glitter. It can block a surprising amount of light and ruin the fairy silhouette effect. Wrap two lengths of twine around the neck of the jar below the bottom rim. Tie in a bow, which you can secure into place with just a drop of instant glue. Add some faux berries, little pine cones, or whatever elements fit your fairy jar. Now pop some light into your jars and enjoy the magic. You can add battery powered tea lights, increasing the intensity by adding extra lights. You can also place a string of battery powered LED lights inside your jar. Pop over to the blog in the description for links to the products used in this project. And remember, it is never ever a good idea to put real fairies into jars.